bro. Who? Sounded like he said horny dragon. Double Dragon Gaiden Rise of the Dragon serves up an exciting beat em up experience reminiscent of games like Streets of Rage 4 and TMNT Shredder's Revenge. This game tastefully fuses retro and modern gaming elements, delivering a nostalgic arcade like feel without the actual arcade. Its versatile gameplay allows you to delve into a roguelike game with permadeath or take the more forgiven route with unlimited continues. A highlight is the exploration aspect with each level, enabling players to traverse through various rooms and stumble upon unexpected ones. Despite a lot of the enemies looking the same, they each provide a distinct combat experience. It's a welcome change to see varying enemy types in each level rather than a repetitive roster. The roster of unlockable fighters is not only noticeable for its size, but it's got 14 unlockable playable characters, each with their own unique attributes. Boss characters can be unlocked and deployed with their unique abilities intact. Certain characters can handle enemy weapons. Some can launch enemies into their own aerial attacks, while others can utilize environmental objects as makeshift weapons. Double Dragon Gaiden encourages strategic gameplay by allowing you to pair characters into tag teams whose strength and weaknesses balance each other out. This provides a wide range of attack options for any scenario that may come your way. Another interesting feature is the mission structure. You have the choice of four missions at the outset, each characterized and color coded based on the area's prominent gang boss, similar to Mega Man's legendary mechanics. These missions can be tackled in any order. As you complete each one, the remaining missions extend in length and the enemies grow stronger as each gang fortifies their defenses. I really like that Double Dragon Gaiden has localized co-op or couch co-op, whichever you'd like to call it. And both players have tag teams. So technically you're playing with up to four players on the battlefield, even if there's only two of you sit beside each other. After completing each stage, you can invest your winnings on roguelike style enhancements to improve your maximum health, strengthen special moves, or bestow buffs on one partner when the other falls. Tokens and Double Dragon Gaiden can be used to unlock a variety of bonuses, from new characters to fresh soundtracks, offering a treasure trove of discoveries. In conclusion, Double Dragon Gaiden Rise of the Dragon was a joy to play and promises to continue providing hours of fun. For many years to come. The cutscene. Whoo! She got a whip. She gonna whip me. This gonna hurt. Glizzy. Hey. Yeah! Thank you so much for tuning in to my Double Dragon Gaiden review. Let me know your favorite Double Dragon game down in the comments and yeah until the next video have a good day